Hey everyone, so Russ here again. Uh, I just want to show you a little bit of something I did this evening with some scrap. Uh, I'm getting ready to saw some logs here on my sawmill and lately every time I want to saw a log I gotta grab the old tractor, grab a log and stick it on the sawmill, saw it once I'm done with it, go grab another log, put it on the sawmill, saw and so on and so forth. So uh, you know a little bit of wear and tear on the tractor on a starter and, and this and that so I grabbed some scrap today some uh, 6 by 8 and uh, 8 by 8s and some stuff and I built a uh, I guess you'd call it a carriage or like a log carriage it goes in front of the mill there it is there so I put that together and uh, we're gonna see how it works I'll get the truck the tractor set up and uh, we'll put some logs on her Here's my sawmill by the way, it's a SMG Champion, it's made out of Quebec, Canada. Great sawmill, bought this almost six years ago, been sawing ever since. It's got a 20 horsepower, fuel injected engine, V-twin. I think it's a, uh, it's a Kohler engine. Uh, I can saw 17 feet, two inches long. Uh, diameter, uh, oh, right around 30 inches I think, I can saw pretty big trees. Anyway, like I was saying, I've got to grab the tractor with my forks, grab a log, come on over to the sawmill, put it on the sawmill, saw it, and then grab another log. So this way, uh, I can put a bunch of logs here now. So I cut a, a eight by eight and a half. I've got an eight by six there. And uh, I can stack, I don't, I don't know, I can put six or eight logs, so it'll be a while I can saw those up before I grab my tractor to grab a, a few more logs. What I did here, I just grabbed some more scrap metal pieces. And what this does is it joins the, the log carriage to the mill. So I just grab this, set it down, it's got a little bit of a groove there. Grab this guy too. Same thing, and I've got uh, logs going in the mill, take them off, and away I go.